I don't know if you've noticed, uh, but while he's been overseas, the president has not been tweeting as much. I assume it's because he's too cheap to pay for data roaming. <laughs> But it might also be because last week, Trump aides staged a Twitter intervention. <laughs> what? You can't take Twitter away from Trump? That's like taking the nudity away from Game of Thrones. It's the reason why we watch the show. <laughs> now, this, this Twittervention was arranged because aides have been concerned about the president's use of Twitter to push inflammatory claims. Yes, I mean, there's a lot of reason to be concerned. History has shown that if he keeps saying all this crazy stuff, I mean, he could win another presidential election. <laughs> and... That's... <laughs> Keep smiling. And there's urgency, because Trump staff fears they may soon lose their jobs. As one source put it, the president goes through moods where sometimes he wants to blow everything up. Um, excuse me. If he goes through moods where he wants to blow everything up, maybe it's not Twitter you should be taking away from him. <laughs> now, apparently... <laughs> now, apparently, this intervention included White House staff only, but there are plenty of us who have been deeply affected by President Trump's tweet, so I just want to take a second to speak to President Trump personally. I wrote this... I wrote this letter as part of the intervention, sir. <laughs> Dear President Trump, your tweeting has affected me in the following ways. My ratings are up. <laughs> but President Trump, some nights, half my monologue is just about things you've tweeted. You're squeezing out other fun news stories. Did you know that San Francisco is opening a rat cafe? They are. That's real. <laughs> you took that away from me. <laughs> we want you to accept help, or the very least, autocorrect. <laughs> How many ways can you misspell independent counsel? So please, give up this harmful addiction and find another coping mechanism. Have you tried drinking? because that's what I've been doing, and it's going pretty great. <laughs> we'll be right back with Kevin Spacey.